So, I know everybody does unboxing videos, but is the Metal Gear Rising Revengeance? <laughs> mm, this beauty here that I must talk about and tell you of its goodness. So, I'm just going to do an unboxing here because it's been the game I've been waiting for for a long time and I don't care. And it's pretty cool. So, we're just going to go through a little unboxing. I just picked this up at midnight at GameStop and so I shall show you what I got. And first of all, they gave you this um, Metal Gear Rising Revengeance art book for everybody who pre-ordered. All in all, like this first picture they start off with, dear God, I hope this happens. I hope you get on a Tron-like motorcycle, start slicing up baddies with your dog compadre there to help slice them up with you. Well, all in all, it's a nice little art book. It's glossy. It's got some artwork of Yoji Shinkawa. If you're into that thing, you love it. If you're not, you won't. It's free. It's cool. I like it. Uh, up next is the Complete Official Guide Collector's Edition. Developers, publishers, people who make these guides, this is how you do a Collector's Edition guide. You see this? You see this, how nice and unassuming it is? It's like, hey, we know you're a collector. We know you bought this because, well, right. So, uh, we're going to put this picture on the front. No, no big old words on the front, nothing. Look, look, it's just right. This is right. It needs being the man. And you look in the back. Oh, look at that. It's so clean. It's so nice. See, that's well done. I mean, I would say I really like the way this guy is done. Of course, you look on the inside. This has a special edition 16-page guide. Uh, it also has a limited edition lithograph here. A little Yoji Shinkawa artwork that's in there, which is cool. Uh, the guide itself, which... I really gotta go over much. Looks good enough. I really wish Future Press would have done this because I love their work on Bayonetta, I love their work on Vanquish. I think they understand these games better than anyone. I don't know how much I use this. I just, I got this because I just had to have everything. So I'll look through it. It's it's cool looking. Uh, the paper is nice. It's kind of printed on a, it's slick, but it's not like overly slick. It's more like a matte type finish. And let's just get to the main event, ladies and gentlemen, which is this big beauty here because uh, that's what we all came for. Let me uh, cut the security and there we go. Okay. Uh, before I do, by the way, it's kind of got it's like the dual sides of Ryan. That's the, the art books like that too. You got the blue side here and then you got the red side here. Kind of the duality of Raiden, I assume, is kind of what I'm getting. Cut what you will. Metal Gear Rising Revenge marks the departure from Metal Gear Solid, still forming with the birth of a new high-speed action game figuring Cyborg Ninja. Right. And I did get this for the PS3, which by the way, if you're still figuring out what system to get it for, get it for the PS3. It's, it's technically the best. Oh, and I got this uh, warning here, as I say. Warning, do not plug in or attempt to operate the unit if the glass is cracked or broken. Please repack it and return to the purchase location. Do not attempt to replace or repair any part of the unit. Wow, you must read the enclosed operation instructions before operating the lamp. <laughs> I don't think so. We're not gonna worry about that. The top here, which I'm liking what they're doing is they came with the game wrapped up, which is normal, but then you have the steel book in a separate case. So you have the game, but if you want to show off the steel case, you can do that. And uh, this is, you know, the steel case, very slick, got riding on the front. It's got a nice picture of him in the pooch in the inside, double disc, and then the uh, Zat Danu, or I'm not even saying it right, sorry, Zat Zat. Look at that. I, I'm, I'm, I'm embarrassed myself. So there's there too. Okay, very cool. And we take that out. Oh, and then this is this is the big one here. We're gonna have to. There's old riding ready to kill. Look at him. Let's just pull this out here. Let's just come out gingerly. All right. And then that's after this big box. Uh, huh. Okay. Okay. So uh, little thing here, little foam thing here. I'm gonna. Oh, 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 looky there. It's already starting to show. Oh, it's going to be beautiful. Yeah, oh, look at that, baby. Ooh, mama. There's more. Come on to me, Papa. There we go. Come on. Come on, fight with me. Man, they really make you work for that, don't they? I think there's a power supply down here. Hold on. Why can I have three hands power adapter? And this box is, you know, it's got some markings on it. Metal Gear Rise and Revenge. It's kind of cool. Let's take these protective cuffs off of this. And I know you're all snickering, making comments. You dirty bird, you. Ooh. 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 That's like a real blade in there. That looks like a real blade. I, man, that looks like a real blade in there. It's got kind of a sharp, I think that's a real blade. 99% sure that's a real blade. Yep. Power supply here. 
plug this in. Okay, and now the moment of truth. Mmm, I like that a lot. Oh yeah, it's got the name etched in there. That's etched in there actually pretty nice. The, the whole build, oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh man, that's pretty cool. I know, I know it's expensive, but that's pretty freaking cool. As far as a pre, as far as a bonus that comes in a special edition, dude, this, dude, let's let's check this out. The lights off. Hold on, I gotta check. Oh, yeah. Oh man, that's so beautiful. Oh, I love it. Wow. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That's a quick unboxing of the Metal Gear Rising Revengeance Limited Collector's Edition goodie bag here. I know, everybody's talked about it, but I had to do it myself, so I, all in all, I'm impressed. And I'm happy with my purchase because this is like the creme de la creme here. This will just be on forever. It'll be on for never go off. And uh, all in all, very much worth the money if you're a Metal Gear fan. I, I would, I'd do it again. I don't have any regrets about this at all. I was a little bit worried, but all in all, this thing, worth the money. All right, all. Thank you. I gotta play. See you later. Woo.